Chukchi C. Russian, Kukotskoy Mor Tr. Chukotskoy Mor, IPA, T. Kots Mor is a marginal sea of the Arctic Ocean. It is bounded on the west by the Long Strait, off Wrangell Island, and in the east by Point Barrow, Alaska, beyond which lies the Beaufort Sea. The Bering Strait forms its southernmost limit and connects it to the Bering Sea and the Pacific Ocean. The principal port on the Chukchi Sea is Ulan in Russia. The International Date Line crosses the Chukchi Sea from northwest to southeast. It is displaced eastwards to avoid Wrangell Island as well as the Chukotka Autonomous Okrug on the Russian mainland. Geography <laughs> 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 The sea has an approximate area of 595,000 square kilometers, 230,000 square miles, and is only navigable about 4 months of the year. The main geological feature of the Chukchi Sea bottom is the 700 kilometer long, 430 miles Hope Basin, which is bound to the northeast by the Herald Arch. Depths less than 50 meters, 160 feet, occupy 56% of the total area. The Chukchi Sea has very few islands compared to other seas of the Arctic. Wrangell Island lies at the northwestern limit of the sea, Harold Island is located near its northern limit, and a few small islands lie along the Siberian and Alaskan coasts. The sea is named after the Chukchi people, who reside on its shores and on the Chukotka Peninsula. The coastal Chukchi traditionally engaged in fishing, whaling and the hunting of walrus in this cold sea. In Siberia places along the coast are, Cape Billings, Cape Schmidt, Amguyima River, Cape Vankarim, the large Kolyuchinskaya Bay, Neskinpiljan Lagoon, Cape Sertsi Cayman, Enyormino, Chejitnan River, Inchun, Ulan and Cape Desnev. In Alaska, the rivers flowing into the Chukchi Sea are the Kivalina, the Kobuk, the Kokolik, the Kukporuk, the Kukpik, the Notak, the Utukuk, the Pitmagia, and the Wulik, among others. Of rivers flowing in from its Siberian side, the Amguyima, Ionivyam, and the Chejitan are the most important. Extent The International Hydrographic Organization defines the limits of the Chukchi Sea as follows On the west the eastern limit of East Siberian Sea from the northernmost point of Wrangell Island through this island to Cape Blossom thence to Cape Yakin on the mainland 176 degrees 40 e. On the north. A line from Point Barrow, Alaska 71 degrees 20 and 156 degrees 20 w to the northernmost point of Wrangell Island 179 degrees 30 w. On the south. The Arctic Circle 66 degrees 33 minutes 39 seconds north between Siberia and Alaska. The northern limit of the Bering Sea. Common usage is that the southern extent is further south, at the narrowest part of the Bering Strait which is on the 66th parallel north. Chukchi Sea Shelf the Chukchi Sea Shelf is the westernmost part of the continental shelf of the United States and the easternmost part of the continental shelf of Russia. Within this shelf, the 50-mile Chukchi Corridor acts as a passageway for one of the largest marine mammal migrations in the world. Species that have been documented migrating through this corridor include the bowhead whale, beluga whale, Pacific walrus, and bearded seals. History. In 1648, Semyon Desnyov sailed from the Kalima River on the Arctic to the Anadir River on the Pacific, but his route was not practical and was not used for the next 200 years. In 1728, Vitus Bering and in 1779, Captain James Cook entered the sea from the Pacific. On 28 September 1878, during Adolf Erik Nordenskjeld's expedition that made the whole length of the Northeast Passage for the first time in history, the steamship Vega got stuck in fast ice in the Chukchi Sea. Since further progress for that year was impossible, the ship was secured in winter quarters. Even so, members of the expedition and the crew were aware only a few miles of ice-blocked sea lay between them and the open waters. The following year, two days after Vega was released, she passed the Bering Strait and steamed towards the Pacific Ocean. In 1913, Karlik, abandoned by expedition leader Vilhjalmor Stefansson, drifted in the ice along the northern expanses of the Chukchi Sea and sank, crushed by ice near Harold Island. 
The survivors made it to Wrangell Island, where they found themselves in a hopeless situation. Then Captain Robert Bartlett walked hundreds of kilometers with Katoktovic, an Inuit man, on the ice of the Chukchi Sea in order to look for help. They reached Cape Vankarim on the Chukotka coast, on April 15, 1914. Twelve survivors of the ill-fated expedition were found on Wrangell Island nine months later by the King & Winch, a newly built Arctic fishing schooner. In 1933, the steamer Chelyuskin sailed from Murmansk, east bound to attempt a transit of the Northern Sea Route to the Pacific, in order to demonstrate such a transit could be achieved in one season. The vessel became beset in heavy ice in the Chukchi Sea, and after drifting with the ice for over two months, was crushed and sank on 13 February 1934 near Kolyuchin Island. Apart from one fatality, her entire complement of 104 was able to establish a camp on the sea ice. The Soviet government organized an impressive aerial evacuation, under which all were rescued. Captain Vladimir Varanin and expedition leader Otto Schmidt became heroes. Following several unsuccessful attempts, the wreck was located on the bed of the Chukchi Sea by a Russian expedition, Chelyuskin 70, in mid-September 2006. Two small components of the ship's superstructure were recovered by divers and were sent to the ship's builders, Burmeister and Wayne of Copenhagen, for identification. In July 2009, a large mass of organic material was found floating in the sea off the northwest Alaskan coast. Analysis by the U.S. Coast Guard has identified it as a large body of algal bloom. On 15 October 2010, Russian scientists opened a floating polar research station in the Chukchi Sea at the margin of the Arctic Ocean. The name of the station was Severny Polyus 38 and it was home to 15 researchers for a year. They conducted polar studies and gathered scientific evidence to reinforce Russia's claims to the Arctic. Topic fauna Topic The polar bears living on the pack ice of the Chukchi Sea are one of the five genetically distinct Eurasian populations of the species. Topic Phytoplankton Topic In 2012, scientists from the Cold Regions Research and Engineering Laboratory published findings describing the discovery of the largest known oceanic phytoplankton algal bloom in the world. The findings were unexpected as it was previously believed that the plankton grows only after the seasonal ice melt, yet some algae was discovered under several meters of intact sea ice. Topic oil and gas resource topic The Chukchi Shelf is believed to hold oil and gas reserves as high as 30 billion barrels 4.8 times 109 cubic meters. Several oil companies have competed for leases on the area, and on 6 February 2008, the U.S. government announced the successful bidders would pay $2.6 billion for extraction rights. The auction drew considerable criticism from environmentalists. In 2015, the Obama administration's Bureau of Ocean Energy Management gave a conditional approval for Shell Oil to drill in shallow 140 feet 43 meters deep Chukchi Sea waters. In September 2015, Shell announced that it was ending its oil exploration in the region, citing tremendous cost and declining oil prices. Shell vowed to return, but eventually gave up all but one of the corporation's leases in the Arctic. Topic. See also Topic. Continental Shelf of Russia List of seas Seven seas Topic. References Topic. Topic. Further reading Topic. Topic. External links. Topic. Ecological assessment. Audubon, Alaska's Arctic Marine Synthesis, Atlas of the Chukchi and Beaufort Seas.